Yes, guys, good morning, good morning. Welcome yeah, back man. to the channel, you know. Welcome back to our okay. channel. Um, this time we're at a different location this morning. Yeah, man, me and Ken are the same way. Mm, but a spotter, I want a regular spot as well. And um, this spot now is a spot where we have to really wait till you see welcome before you can come here. So because it's a spot where always dirty. But you win higher now and you pass to see a little up the road and look. The, the wind and the sea, but you can see so the water clean, so it make it a little whitey whitey and uh, a little bit choppy. Yeah, man. So, we kind of 80% 80 sure, so you have to have a little muddy to it. There, get out the gears them already. So we are going to use, as we say, half our way through this morning. You know what Jamaica this with the wet suit not really necessary to that because of the weather where we are about here. Our temperature always hot most of the time. Yeah, yeah man, it's well hot. And the water kinda of chilly sometimes, but not like how some other country that it's chilly too, like you know, but you know that cold. You don't have cold water. So a wet suit only mainly serve to protect our body from certain things. You understand? That are the main purpose of which we should have out there. To protect our body. Nobody okay. else, I have on the bottom. I have on my top swim shirt over it. So you know it's good. Yeah, man. So we are going down the, the little piece of pass, you know. We reach from the, the seaside and we see how it's there. Yeah, we will check out the water. We go in there and see how it's there. Stag along, alright? Meet Nasa Lynx. He's a photographer, a wildlife adventurer, a grateful harvester of Mother Earth, and a legendary spear fisherman. He explores the ocean where he encounters some of Jamaica's most vicious predators while he captures breathtaking underwater footages and forages for food in order to survive. He cooks up a storm and produces mouth watering dishes that will make you lick your finger. Welcome to Original Living with Nasa Lynx. Ah, uh, different place that go. That go hot, so. Let's take, let's take that one. Ah, look tasty. Yes, so, so we are going down from the seaside, you know. Man, and the water looks kind of alright. You can see the stone stone them out of the reef, so that's a good look. That's a nice thing there. Just want to know we can see something, you know, guys. And the fish them come out, you know. And when the water does the fish, most fish hide, you know. Mm, but if they smart at best time, then should have come out. You know, I thought that they have been less people in here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The slippers are letting me go, you know. Yeah, yeah. Mm, we, can't, we can't see in the reef, we can't see some of the stone stone them. So, that no mean it 100%. But it have a little visibility. Come on, so let's we'll see what go on out here. Mm -hmm. But I might spot this again to you, but we now go do a lot of dive here because of the the the, 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 the type of spot this is. This is a spot as we said before. The sea of a calm, calm before anything, any good diving can really happen here. Man, but it's a good here, you know. Nice piece of land will come through to empty land. I'm gonna give you a spot, but I don't want to give it to any to sell. I mean, I'm gonna get it to buy it first. Mm, wish I can't afford them, not with a long stick. Man, 
and so yeah prep area prep up and go out there you see, you see a lot of battles but we know them they are fish but no no nobody yeah man let me shoot one of my best fish here so too mm, a pampa or a permit jack yeah man so i'll get the rest of gears on and uh, head into the water you know skin hard up yesterday stop a vlog yeah man we we'll put on the rest of these And head out, all right? So the water was very murky at the point that we enter from. Very sandy. So we started to head down the sea. So we can find some better visibility. Here I saw a little snapper. Make after it, it held up in the murk. As you guys can see, the water very dirty. So here can add us a jack. Over that rock, but couldn't take that shot with this two rubber band set and this spear gun. This spear will definitely get stuck in the rock. So here we saw this fish pot up on top of the reef. It's about 40 feet of water with a good amount of jack inside. So we dive down to check it out. This fish pot seem abandoned. It didn't set. I saw a couple mutton snapper in about 60 feet of water. So I can't make the first jump on one. Somehow he turned back. So 
So I decided to make the second job. So here I came in close to this one, line it up and took the shot. Land a great shot there. This is actually the first fish for the boat of us. See that one is a lovely snapper. We have to stick to the deep because in the shallow the water was very dirty. So hole in the deep here, we can see a little bit. a shark in the area, then out of sight, I didn't, so I couldn't say which species. So get this one on the buoy quick. this heavy area and this is about 60 feet made a first job but I didn't warm up good enough so I have to turn back so I sit on the top and breathe up and head down back saw the barracuda he seems as he go up in the rocks but I knew that he didn't left that spot I knew that he's there but the current was so strong there and I was losing too much energy so I head back to the top and move on difficult here to dive and it was a lovely sized barracuda probably a 12 pound one so here I came up on this lovely turtle this one is large It's been a while since I came in this close to one. Very tame. This 
species of turtle is the one that they call loggerhead turtle. Very beautiful. Whenever I dive, this is the things that I love to see. So I move on from the turtle and I saw some guns in and out of this rock here. So I made a sneak up jump and jump from the next side and sneak around. Here you can see them in and out of the rock. So I'm trying to pick out one of the big ones. Here's a lovely one. Took that one. run up underneath the rock with the line so I have to head to the top and try to see if I could pull him out but he wasn't coming so I have to head down back just up in the hole floating it was the rock that stuck in the line and I saw a few more up in that rock so in my mind I'm saying I'm just gonna shoot this one and make a second of them nice size for a gun one on my stringer and head back down this time one band set and the second inch don't need that amount of power when I got down here it seems that I have lost the hole Looking and looking I saw an next hole with a few inside. So I line up one. and it and it's lovely one this one hasn't as big as the last one but good size while I'm coming up the shooting line gets stuck on the rock again so I have to release it and head back down to get it this one as well and I decided to make one last drop at the same spot because I was seeing a lot of them in the world so I head down back and I 
didn't have my flashlight with me. So I couldn't see clearly in the hole. I saw a couple of them in there. Some small ones, but didn't want to spear any of the small ones. So I feel satisfied with what I got, the snappers and the two guns, so I left. I'm going a little bit closer in the shallow and head up the sea. So here I saw a lovely cool tail here. This is the end of this dive. Catch you guys on the rock side. Yes, guys, yes, guys. So we jump out of the water, you know. Yeah, man. We left Canada, come down there, so. And um, the reef near us, so I don't know where we're off it. Yeah, man, see the reef right, so. So I left him right there, so. Yeah, man. And as I said, the water here, so it's dirty, but. Dirty bad bad. We have to swim go way down the sea on the deeper side to get a little visibility. Yeah man, we reach way down we turn back and come up back. Yeah man, cause about a mile we swim. Mm. Water dirty bad still and the current not that bad still but you see calm. See calm same way, you know. But it's dirty. Yeah man, not, uh, couple of days that's all better still see it still find two fish still yeah man so when we come in back with you a nice snapper you know i wanna can weigh about three pound mm. lovely two grunt two nice grunt you know I could have get more than grunt you know and we find the nest of them you know and holy did but I say, I get a nice snapper already and thing. I mean, I don't have to stress myself, you know. Mm -hmm. Two nice fish, man. Yeah, I left Canada and I ain't spear no fish yet still. So, I wonder. Me and him are come up on here. No film style. I'm going to tap, tap uh, and see if he can find two fish. A film style at. I mean, when I'm done, this I come still. So, I'm going to clean up them yeah, until he come in you know so I don't have a stress the camera but I have one bar left for me with me a scale of fish because I want to show you how to come in back with me I don't park and we up some park so I don't get no more about you for now so I have to peace I don't know what things set. nice one you know well nice well satisfied good catch this you know Mm. I'll go and rub off, you know. Now, get you me a scale, you know, because the battery I go as I say, I'm going to catch the canard when he come in back. Mm. Fish are easy for scale still, you know. So, I'm wrap this in some file paper in the board, you know, and season him up and, you know, drop him. Yeah, so finish the clean up, you know. Yeah, man, scale and gut. That's all what type of clean up, you know. Scale and gut. Yeah, man, and, yeah. Just see Kennard, Kennard, the right side of the reef, yeah, so. I think you can see him from this, so. from here, from the camera view, but I can see him. Yeah, man, in the right in the reef, yeah, so. I come in, you know. Yeah, I have to me a pint the wrong place. I don't know if this one is white buckle. So. Yeah, man, in the right there. So. Right by my finger there. So. Yeah, you see, all up here there a while ago. I walk him off to walk him out there. So, you know. Because you so can't swim. Because it's tight drop. You get low this morning when you go into the water. Low, low, you know. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to hold on and see when he comes in with you, you know. 
I don't know much find not much still because I left him in the spear not me and I only spear the one fish I hope you find it toward the ground there he must have to turn up and walk come in you know whoa he must have a nice string there with a lot to push on him man wow and he come in still he came out there I cannot find nice string in you know, a boy. I find more when I do a catch. I left him without. He come in with two lovely octopus here too. Yeah. And two nice sea cat that you know. Mm, fine fish man. A nice fish. Yeah, mm, you don't know what thing set. What a dirty bad out there still, you know? Oh, I ain't see him man. I ain't see him man. I see him. You know me like him. See that? I'm never out of man. I just come back. Come back. Mmm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 Yeah man, so guys, I'm going to do a cook up you now, so stay tuned. Alright, I hit the road you now. Yeah man, so stay tuned to the channel. So I'm home now, guys, and this is what I have. Lovely snap on the two grunt. Well, I'm going to put away the two grunts and I'm going to file the snappers on myself from before. Yeah man, I'll get some season on it. Mm, and catch up my, 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 my jerk pan so I'm calling it and catch it up yeah so I'm going to start the process and now yeah man so go out and reach the other side of the top got some slice going tonight yeah now Any look of seasoning, you know. Mm, I feel almost like a gunshot in a way of sharp. My way I could have said. Touch on me and the jump off a gun. Can I use the bus off the tail? Can I not want the tail? Especially this one I put down you know. This one is new you know. So half a pack of new people on it. Mm. Take one. Take one. Take 
take a minute to voir si ils ont un go in I look a bit. Buy some some of the things that we have in the house. Not much. Onion. That now, you know, I'll catch up a fire, you know? guys. You know, I forgot to put in the thing, man. The butter and the butter does the right here, say, you know, you when know, I couldn't remember me, man. Well, me pull it back, see, me just saw me feel that grease the paper, all that, man. You know, but what no, me just saw cut up on two slices, it chunky and drop in it, no problem. It's supposed to out again. Yeah, man, one go, you know. Soon spread them out, and you don't know a thing go fish on on it. Pressy girl, pan, you know. Drop the sauna now, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go 
come in. Get this the first turnover, you know. Move mm -hmm. like that. Oh, 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 the rapping's rapping. Rest on the camera. Rest on the camera. That piece I close it in, you know, and they come off. Whoa. I'm going to go down and eat it now. Just mm. make it go and steam out. Just make it say feel soft and nice, you know, man. Every time I come back out here, I'm going to test it, you know. Yes, I'm going to test it, you know, you know. I don't want to take off the camera and I don't want to take off the camera I don't want to take off the camera Snappy line, mm. One big dinner this. Mm -hmm. yeah, man. Also, I go on for this, you know. You mm. like me not go on the front of me, I go sit down and eat this. I could do that, no? Yes, guys, you know. After the breeze, yeah. Thank you. 